Sarah and the apple. It was a bright and beautiful morning. Sarah was ready for the day. What was that sound? Rumble, rumble. Sarah was hungry and wanted to snack on an apple. A big, delicious, juicy red apple. So she went to the kitchen to look for one. First, Sarah checked the fruit basket on the counter. Inside were oranges, bananas, and grapes, but no apples. Then she opened the fridge. She saw milk, butter, and cheese, but no apples. She went to the pantry. On the shelves, she found canned peaches, spaghetti sauce, and rice, but no apples. Sarah felt sad and her stomach was getting louder. Daddy, Sarah cried, I'm hungry, but I can't find any apples. Sarah's dad said, would you like to go with me to the farmer's market? Sarah got excited because she was sure she would find apples there. At the farmer's market, Sarah found a world of apples. She was ready to explore. As Sarah walked around, she noticed something. There was something different about each apple that she saw. Some apples were really big and round. Other apples were small and shaped like a heart. Some apples looked smooth, while other apples looked bumpy. And each apple had a different color. She saw sweet apples. She saw sour apples. She saw candied apples on sticks and caramel apples with nuts on top. There were apples in a pie. There were apples in a cake. There were even jars of apples made into applesauce. It's amazing how many kinds of apples there are and how many things you can make with them, exclaimed Sarah. Rumble, rumble. Sarah held her stomach. I was so excited about being here that I forgot I was hungry. Daddy, may we buy some of the small red apples, please? They look the most delicious to me. Sarah's dad bought a basket of small red apples. He picked one apple from the basket and said, This apple is a body. What do you notice about this apple? Sarah held it and said, It's small and red. It's round and feels smooth. She put it to her nose, sniffed, and said, It smells delicious and fresh. She took a bite and said, It's crunchy and juicy at the same time. It's sweet and so delicious. Sarah's dad explained, Color, size, shape, smell, and taste describe how this apple is. They are attributes of this body. No, my darling Sarah, God is the creator of all the bodies and their attributes. God is not a body and he does not have any attributes of the bodies.